He's peeling a cucumber. And we've got some yummy chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> uh, what else? Yeah, we really, uh, really good pasture-raised chicken. Gonna go on the grill in a little bit. And we're gonna have some uh, emblem tomatoes, uh, some mozzarella, and just very light, light dinner, Mediterranean style. A little bit of yogurt dip. A little, you know what? We have this new bread from. Oh, that'd uh, be nice. Be nice and crunchy. Yeah. We well, can do like a garlic bread with some butter. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna warm up the cauliflower thins, but we can do that instead. Yeah, we might as well try it. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Rose, let's peel it and then you can have it. Hmm? All yeah. right. Play a city family. I hope you're having a grand Sunday. Here, then you can cut it. My two favorite ladies in the world are here. DJ D. Slav, all the way from the BG. Rose Honey Parish. Yeah. Had a lovely uh, morning at the pool today. Now it's time to cook, and I actually want to get the chicken on immediately. So, mm -hmm. quick rundown of the chicken. Nice, Rose. Look. Uh, it's the pasture raised, slow grown, heirloom yeah. variety you know, chicken from Cook's Venture. Mm -hmm. um, they have some of this chicken on Thrive Market but they don't have the, um, the chicken box anymore. It's by pieces, I believe. Um, this is the best pasture-raised chicken ever. I slathered it with ghee, the Thrive Market right. ghee, salt, pepper, oregano, uh, parsley, rosemary from the garden. I'm like a Simon and Garfunkel song. Uh, and then I Oops. took ghee and put it underneath the breast meat skin because breast meat has no fat. It tends to dry out. Mm. Any love that you can give that, it's great. I have the Traeger have going at 425. I'm going to put it on there right now because it takes 45 minutes. I'll be back. Oh, give me one of those cucumbers. Mm, good. I'm so good. Why not? I think that's the last one. Eat it because Daddy and I are going to finish the mom. Yeah. Cut some more and then have a snack. Yum, num. How you guys doing? <laughs> yeah, what else shall we have for a snack? The date balls. The date balls. You gonna help Daddy make the yogurt sauce? Yeah. Fun fact, yeah. whenever you preheat your Traeger, you gotta do it like away from your patio because it smokes like crazy, right? Yeah. Crazy amount of smoke. But once it gets the heat, it doesn't do that. And Daddy's putting the chicken on the ground. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Put it on the grill okay. and then forget about it, right? For a little bit. It's just gonna cook there. Oh, I think I have to raise the temperature a little bit. So after about 20 minutes, I'm going to kick the temperature up to 450. So I want it to get nice and crispy. And the flavor, the Traeger imparts on the uh, chicken is loco. Right, Deso? Uh, yeah, it's really good. It's an amazing chicken. Obviously, you can do it in the oven. Oven, I would do um, 425 for 40 minutes and then raise it up to 475 for another 10 to 15 minutes. Or just on the grill, on indirect heating. But a Traeger is a wood pellet grill, and it basically is like an oven that smokes at the same time. It's a great investment. But I gotta raise the heat just a little bit yeah, here. We have one more cucumber. You have one more. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll wash it for you. I have some really nice uh, cherry careful, wood careful. pellets in there. No, careful, careful, oh, careful, careful sweetheart. Can Daddy have a piece of cucumber roast? All right, welcome, y'all. Please leave comments down below. Let us know where you're watching from. Let us know what you're making for Sunday supper. Hanging out with the family. Thrive Market, once again, is the sponsor of the live stream. Use my promo link in the description box. The very first line. I forgot what it is. It's thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Live, I believe. Here's what you get when you... Here's my promo code, 25% off your first order, a free gift up to $40, and it's 30 days risk-free. But the cool thing is, um, I put all my favorite Thrive Market items in the description box here, and you'll see food items, clo uh, clothing, uh, face items, pills, vitamins, uh, soap, uh, toothpaste, all that stuff. Thrivemarket.com slash Bobby Lie gets you 25% off your first order. Try Thrive Market. It's cheaper than the grocery store. Did you peel your finger, Rose? <laughs> You're going to love it. All right, we got salmon from dinner from MT. 
Jackie Adam Spiegel's in the house. Go Ju Jang's in the house. Mm. UK in the house. Viviana Barraza oh, from upstate Vivi. New York is in the house. Vivi. 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 Uh, Rose lost a chug, the little fruit syrup from Crown Valley. That's hilarious. Mm -hmm. Florida Panhandles here. Gilbert, Arizona. Trinidad and Tobago. I was there many years ago for a wedding, actually. It was a pain in the butt to get to, but very beautiful. <laughs> Looks like we're going back to Turks and Caicos the first week of October. Back to paradise. Back to reality. Back to life. Look at you chopping, Rose. My goodness gracious. Yeah, with the knife. You've upgraded, Rosie. Unbelievable. You upgrade because you're practicing with the knife a lot. So, Your chicken other veggies, on the yeah. grill. We're going to make a heirloom tomato and vegan mozzarella okay. caprese salad. Can I get you the bowl? We're going to uh, uh, warm bowl. some um, naturally fermented... Uh, gluten-free sourdough bread from San Francisco. It's a cool company called Bread Seriously. Um, and then I also want to make the layered chocolate chip cookies that are, have a kale in there, and they're egg-free, and they have coconut sugar. So yeah, I used to crush uh, the bread seriously before, oh but uh, it was made with rice. White rice flour. White rice flour. Yeah. And then um, recently, I think they've launched a new one. Uh, it's these. It's these uh, dinner rolls and a cinnamon bread that has no um, rice and no potato starch. So it's really good. It's it's really good. But so the key for the sourdough is I don't think Rose is gonna like it. But the key to these is like to um, really toast them. Once you toast them, it gets so crispy on the outside. Let me spit it out. Crispy. But, but tell folks what's so interesting about the. The actual fermentation or the sourdough. Yeah, they, they do a natural fermentation with the sorghum flour. So it's like an organic sorghum flour starter um, sour sourdough. And um, the other ingredients are arrowroot, millet flour, sorghum flour, and psyllium husk. That's it. So what's the difference between sourdough that has yeast versus natural fermentation? Yeah, the natural fermentation actually breaks down the... Um, the enzymes in the um, uh, in the um, in the grains and makes them more digestible. That's the real way of making sourdough. Yeah, yeah. There's natural bacterium in the air. You let it mm -hmm. sit in a coolish place, not too cold, and the natural spores go into there. Yeah. If you ever want to buy Can real sourdough, it should always be uh, wild fermented or naturally fermented, because I'm a wild and crazy guy. Yeah, there's cinnamon bread that's uh, rice free. It's so good. Yeah, really so good stuff. Good. Right, let me wash these. It has this like sour um, flavor taste when you eat it. It's really, it's really yummy. But the key is to always toast it. I actually griddle it, right? Griddle. Yeah, it, or griddle it. I never toast these kind of breads like the keto bread I do from Base Culture. I griddle. Is this your book right? Five dollar yeah. holler from Felicia. You brought fun back to cooking without sacrificing enjoyment. Thank you for that, Felicia. All right. I'll bring Any news here. about the knives and cookware from my girl Jackie Haddam? Tuesday, I'm off to Sugarland, Texas, with uh, Erica, my friend, business partner, and manager. We're meeting with uh, Tramontina, who's going to be helping us make and distribute the cookware set. Um, I'll tell you a lot about it on the yeah. Instagram Flav City story on Tuesday and Wednesday. Mostly Wednesday, because we'll be there all day. It'll come out next year. In cookies. my opinion, it's going to be a game changer when it comes to uh, cookware industry. <laughs> That's Rose Honey. So how long on the grill, babe? A total of 45 minutes. Yeah. yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's long. It's a long time. Now let's start griddling this uh, bread of a sample. So we're going to start eating it now? Well, I just wanna, uh, do you want to try sampling it or not? Or Let's try a sample, I guess, with a little tomato and a little... Yeah. Some garlic yeah. butter or yeah. something, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to griddle it in ghee, and then we'll just put the tomato on there with the mozzarella and a hum -hum 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 -hum. Yeah, but I like it when, it when it gets toasted because it gets toasted on all sides. I'm going to griddle the uh, side where it's... I'll do upside down like that. Up like that. Oh, Rose saw the <laughs> iPad. <laughs> oh, Mom says no. Where can I get your cookbook on Amazon, Rose? Oh, uh oh, Rose, look what happened. Look what happened. Darn it, it died. Yeah. Dead. Yeah. Darn it. Eh, it's okay, Rose. It'll come back, I'll charge it up. Our cookbooks are on Amazon. Mom, mom. Mom's phone, and this is coming uh, in Christmas. The Tasty Adventures of Rose Honey Pea, a children's series book. 
We can, we can have a snack? Would you like a snack, Mishka? No. Or you know what? You can bring your um, veggies and you can cut so, them. So, a little cup salad. in a tray. You want to do that? There's some really nice okay. organic heirloom tomatoes on sale right now at Whole Foods. And I wanted to keep it dairy free. There's one dairy free cheese that is better than most. Not all of them in this line, but look at the ingredients. Yeah, it's clean, me. really? Miyoko's plant based mozzarella. Read this. Oh, I'll help you. I'll Read help these ingredients. Cashew milk, coconut oil, tapioca starch, mushroom extract. That's it. No natural flavors, no yeast extract. I cannot wait to try. You know, I'm not, I'm not going to wait to try. I'm going to open it right now. It's a little pricey, right? I believe this was $8 possibly, but right, you're you have slim pickings if you want dairy free. I just didn't feel like having any uh, dairy tonight. We had a little uh, cheddar in our breakfast this morning, but it was a really yummy uh, British grass-fed cheddar. Keep going. They carry also at Whole Foods. Hey, Rose, want to try this? Some cheese? Yeah. Duck? No, no. Why don't you do it up here? No. no. Don't you want to do it up here? No. no. Okay. Try that. Mm. Mm. It's good. It's okay. It's not really, uh, it doesn't taste like. It's a little salty. It doesn't taste like uh, mozzarella. What do you expect, babe? I don't know. It no, has I think a thinner slice and then put it on a bread, I think it's fine. It has almost like this acidic flavor that I don't like. Yeah, it has a little bit of acidic flavor. Rose you, doesn't like it. Yeah. Disappointing. Uh. <laughs> babe, what do you expect? Just get the real thing next time. <laughs> well, I, I actually have the mozzarella organic um, grass-fed mozzarella there. That's the barata. I don't know so. why I didn't get it. Darn it. I had higher hopes. She also has Miyoko a... Um, Cream you can cheese, cut I like it pretty good too. But I like my almond uh, kite hill. Here, use this to cut. All right, guys, if you're just joining, keep leaving comments down below. Let us know where you're watching from. It's time to pour a little bit of Flav City Keto Lemonade. Uh, once again, Thrive Market. Got some great stuff. They're new, new to me. Nice. Sweet nice potato bro. chips cooked in coconut oil yeah, are amazing. We'll I highly sun. recommend checking them out using my promo That's link the in the description box. Clivemarket.com slash Bobby Live and get that 25% you off your first order. Hold it on one side and then cut with the, uh, the other hand. I'm talking to them actually this week. They're uh, hopefully going to pick up my keto lemonade. In the meantime, shopflavecity.com. Shopflavecity.com. Pink grapefruit. Original lemonade, one net carb, no BS Aren't ingredients, you cut it? amazing flavor that no. has the same sweetness as sugar. There's no cooling effect on your tongue. There's no aftertaste because we use really, really good stevia and blended it with a touch of non-GMO Rupertol. Mm. So good. Let me get back to what's going on here. Mm. There we the go. Lemon. I ordered the jars of cookie dough. Oh, nice. Uh, Renee, you're going to love that. The cookie dough. When can we feature a yeah. duck recipe? Oh, it's a good question. A duck cook, recipe? Yeah, I don't cook much duck. I should. Duck is delicious. Sometimes. Last time I did, I had a bunch of duck legs I put on a sheet tray and I just cooked them low and let them cook in their own fat. It's almost like a, a hack version of um, sous vide. It was really lovely. Let's see the dinner roll here. The mint? There's a tea tree, Mom. Actually, this is rose. Wow. Smell Happy rose. Uh, National Ice Cream Day, by the way. This is rose. We're going to celebrate later on with some smell. coconut cult. Or no, with uh, coconut bliss. Rose. A little bit of salt. I always grate all my buns. And I always... Uh, Put salt in the pan, just to season the bread. Gives it a nice little bite. Let's slice up these maters. Mm -hmm. Tomatoes. Oh yeah, with some olive oil and some. Oh yeah. There's some basil still in the garden. Some garlic or something. If you want me to get it. Yeah. Rose uh, is mic'd up if you haven't noticed. Yeah, Rose is mic'd up. So any Rose, questions? Show your microphone. Any oh, questions yeah. for Rose? Hashtag Ask Rose. Yeah, I'll be at Desi here. Hashtag Ask Desi. Yeah, your microphone. Yeah. Your microphone. That way everybody can hear you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everyone can hear you loud and clear. It's uh -huh. beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Look how beautiful these tomatoes are. Oh yeah, they're gorgeous. Wow. Gorgeous heirloom. Well, now it's the season. You it's, like tomatoes, Rose? It's the season for tomatoes. Uh, actually, it's still a, a bit early. I'd say August is like prime time for like homemade. Thank you, baby. Watching from Michigan. Right, but down here I think they get them a little early. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> is it good with vodka? Nice. Mm -hmm. hey, you want Are there differences in stevia? Board? Yes. Cheap stevia okay. tastes like oh, wow. butt. Wow. Get that nasty the flavor. Expensive stevia, we it use the most expensive wow. one possible, really nice. has no aftertaste. So when you drink this, it won't it's taste like a sugar right. alcohol. It won't cool your tongue. It's right. It has the same flavor and aftertaste of regular Can sugar. Help us? So, good question. Here, smell it. Wow. Mm, wow. Oh yeah, Very nice, right, Rachel. I saw Very beautiful flavor. Mm -hmm. that lady Abby Sharp, who's a nutritionist. People are entitled to their own opinions. Listen, and if you want to do a video you know, or piggyback off my name, you're more than welcome to. I stand firmly in the foods I eat and the reason why, and the reason why I think you should maybe eat some of them too. If you want to try to pick apart my diet and tell me I'm wrong about something, you're entitled to your own opinion. But I stand steadfastly by my research my options and what i share with you guys mm -hmm. I, dirk actually told me about it come. she's one of many people who have like, dissected one of my videos and tried to uh tell me i'm wrong 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 no 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 okay tomatoes hey i need someone to put salt on my tomatoes rose mm -hmm. hmm? you want to pinch a little salt on here Rosie? oh you're busy no. want to pinch a little salt on here for dad no no you're busy okay I'll do it. Busy. <laughs> Busy. Rose is saying a lot more words this week. It's very exciting. A little bit of salt. Busy. Busy. You're a busy girl. I don't blame you. Rose is the best. Uh, hashtag Ask Desi. Can you do a video on what beauty products and body washes and lotions and potions you use? I'm still, still researching, actually. Uh, for shampoos, I've been using the Thrive Market ones. A, a, cure. a cure. A cure is great. Uh, Feels great on my hair. Um, Three dollars cheaper on Thrive Market than Whole Foods. Yeah, I've, I've been using this shampoo, like the different ones. Like, it's 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 good to switch up the shampoos. Never use one shampoo for extended periods of time because mm, it point. just builds up on your hair. That makes sense. So like, switch them up. There, I think they have that like several different um, shampoos and several different conditioners. Um, so I really like that. Those. What about face wash? We've been liking lately. Face wash. The one I just reordered. Uh, Pure Haven. Yeah, Pure, Pure Haven, Haven is a really nice one. Yeah, and uh, yeah, and I've been also using um, just the oil cleanser from from Origins, which I like. I think Origins um, isn't that high quality though. From what yeah, I know, but the oil one, I think it's nice. Maybe. And then um, yeah, I just uh, I'm very like low maintenance when it comes to these things. Very low maintenance. Recently, I've just been like spraying just rose water on my face after I um, I clean it, and um, it just feels good. What about the serum? Because it's just so humid here in Florida, True. I don't even need a moisturizer. I well, I use a serum every day. Oh, the serum is serum. great. Yeah. I have a serum from um, Four Sigmatic. I think Bobby has more to say about like face products than I do. Hey, got to keep this forty-three-year-old face That's looking good. That's why they say Bobby looks younger than me, right? Do they say that? Yeah, some people do. Right? Okay, good question, by the way. Oh, happy National Coconut Bliss Day. Nice, Viviana. Um, I have a great uh, promo code I'll share on Instagram. I actually shared it. So when this is done, go to Flay City Instagram. I scored you guys a sweet um, promo code for Coconut Bliss. Thank oh, you, Susan. You Bobby is the best in my personal experience. Follow him Rose? his recommendations. He is right. Mommy and Daddy. Well, here's the thing. I think I'm right, but am I selling you a diet plan or any program? No, I'm just telling you how to buy the best products and ingredients to put in your body. So I think that is the right answer, and it's been working for countless people. I'm not telling you a certain diet per se. Keto diet, sure, if you have real serious weight issues, uh, high numbers, high blood pressure, pre-diabetic. But just looking at the best ingredients to put in your body makes all the difference. That's all I'm doing. What else we got here? Oh, two super chats. Thank you. Go to Jeng. Tori Castellano from Colorado. Oh, Tori, we'll be in, uh, I think, Aspen 
Early Daddy, next month in Vail visiting a friend. Mommy, Thank you for that, Tori. Mommy, Mommy, and Jackie mm -hmm. Haddam Spiegel. Mommy, I just don't need it. $25 from Jackie. Did I miss Mommy, that? Mommy, Mommy, Mommy. There we go. Bobby, that One sounds great. Part. Cannot wait to get the knife. Thank you so we much, love Jackie. So much, huh? My girl, Jackie. Yeah. My daughter makes soap from 100% Italian Costco olive oil. Ooh. 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 Interesting. Oh, here's a, Rachel started her own blog yesterday. What's a crucial thing she should know when just Diddy? starting out? Diddy? That's you. Huh? Um, Rachel just started her blog yesterday. What's a crucial thing she should know when just starting out? Starting out? Uh, build it on WordPress. It's one of the best platforms. As opposed to? As opposed to other, uh, like, kind of like, box stop um, kind of website solutions. Squarespace, like Wix Squarespace. Those are garbage. Uh, you have more control with WordPress, and it's great for SEO. So that's my recommendation. My and recommendation would be focus on SEO incredibly. Yeah. Um, look how the style of blog is built from top bloggers, and then use a website. It's a free tool called SCM Rush. What do you want? Oh, oil! SCM Rush, and you can get a keyword score on certain. Um, you know, yeah. words of recipes and how to phrase them. Is, okay, perfect, Russ. Yeah, you. very important to um, understand SEO and know how to work with it. There's countless, I mean, sources out there to, to uh, learn about it. So, like, research it now and not later. Yes. Um, we did and, the opposite, unfortunately. Yeah, but we, uh, we quickly um, caught up. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing so, how we fixed everything. And the numbers yeah. on the website went crazy because of it. Yeah, SEO is very important. It's a very good question. Anyone can be a blogger. That's yeah. the cool thing. And if you understand what you're doing from the get-go, you'll be ahead of the game. And it could be about anything. Food, makeup, beauty. Let's have a snack. It's crazy. Let's have a snack. Is there something you can recommend as a Don't detox before going on a Bobby-approved diet? What can I give you, Rose? What do you want, Rose? The iPad. Oh. No, the iPad is dead, Mama. No, it's no. dead. No, she kind of sees it's not. It's dead, and then it needs it for comments. Here, here's for Mommy Rose. Give this. I want to try this. Uh, yeah, here you go. Toast. I'm making a perfect one for you. Um, would you prep your body anyway before going on a Bobby-approved diet? Prep your body? Yeah. What do you mean? Detox. She asked. Mm, I, I'd say oh, no. Hot. Mm. No, I, I would not. Because no. you're still going to eat the same foods you love. You're just going to eat best in class ingredients. Ooh. Mmm. Yummy. Yummy. Mm-hmm. Oh. So, mm, so hot for Russian. Yeah, I love this bread. It's nice. Yeah, you don't need to prep anything. Just do it. Don't don't delay. Just do it. It's a cheese. You want a little bit here? Alicia, I'll... go for it. Okay. Also got the cookbook. Thank yeah. you. Balsamic on that. Here, you know a what? Bit of cheese. You want to try that? As usual, Gojujang is right. I don't use balsamic almost ever, Gojujang. I'm just not a big balsamic guy. Do I even have? I do here. It, I don't like balsamic vinegar like this. Here, take that. Bring that to Mommy Rosie. If anything, I'd get yeah, a nice balsamic, balsamic reduction. Balsamic. Like a good syrup, not the bowl crap ones that have like corn syrup and sugar, a real like balsamic vinegar, de modern, modena, you know? Mm. Yeah, yeah. A little bit. A little bit. A uh, little bit. Here, pour it on daddy's just a little bit. Ready and just a little stop. Bit. Stop. Stop. Perfect. Oh, 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 oh. Mmm. Yum. Mm -mm. Want to try it? Try it from the... Nice. Pretty strong. Yeah. Strong. I prefer the reduction, though. I'm not a huge fan of the... Uh, See, it smells pretty strong, huh? Does it smell pretty strong? Yeah. <coughs> what, the balsamic? Mm-hmm. Does it smell strong, Mama? I think she was... Um, what happened? The smell got her from the vinegar. The vinegar? Yeah. The vinegar was too strong. Man. No vinegar for you. Mm -mm. Too strong. Hey, Rose. Who wants to bake some cookies? Hey, you want to mix some cookies? You want to mix some cookies? 
No, we'll it get rid smells. of the vinegar. Okay, I'll, I'll clean it right now. Here, wait, we're going to get rid of it, Rose? The new layered paleo dairy-free cookie mix is amazing. <laughs> yeah, we'll get rid of it, Rose, I promise. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Here, it, it spilled everywhere and it smells. It smells, Rose. Sorry. Gojo Jang, I blame you. Bram. I blame Gojo Jang. Agreed. Hashtag uh -oh. blame uh -oh. Gojo Jang. All done. All done. Done. No more. No more. Come on, let's make some cookies now. Let's make some cookies. Come on. Come here, Rose. No, very strong smell from that vinegar. Oh, my love. Vinegar. Yeah. It's okay, now it's gonna smell good, like chocolate. It's gonna smell like cookies. It's gonna smell like sweet. Wanna smell something better, Rose? Yeah. Smell that. Wanna hear how crazy this is, Rose? One bag has 42 organic kale leaves. <laughs> it's like a whole bunch a of it. A third of a beet. No, 42 kale leaves is two bunches. It's crazy. And over one carrot. <laughs> two and a half servings of vegetables in yeah. here. Okay, here we go, Rose. When Dirk was here, he loved the cookies. Oh, the cookies are the bomb. Here, can you pour Ranger. these into the bowl, Rose? What? Yeah, hold the whole thing. Here, go on your tower. Take this with mommy. Pour it all in there. Mama. Mm -hmm. Mama. That's a nice little snack. Oh, wow. Yeah. Mmm. Good. Good, Rosie. Thank you, Roseanne. Oh, I got to check the chicken. Um, mm. To that, girls, you have to... Wrong timer. You have to add a quarter cup of coconut oil and two tablespoons of water. Mm. Coconut oil should be partially melted from the heat here. This is an amazing coconut oil. I have it on my Thrive Market list. It's the regeneratively grown virgin coconut oil. Regenerative farming really is the future. Amazing stuff. Once again, I put all my Thrive Market favorites in the description box. Mm -hmm. So the first line of the description, bo uh, description box, thrivemarket.com slash bobbylive. Add this. I put all my favorites down there too, and you get 25% off your first order. Rose is eating all the chocolate chips. Actually, I don't know if this is going to be liquid enough. <laughs> Rose, nice. Even the chocolate chips are sweetened with coconut sugar. Isn't that cool? Mmm, right? Yep. Here you guys want to measure a quarter cup? I want some more cheese. You didn't like it, but it actually goes good with the tomatoes. I want to tell them it's not bad. Mm. How much? A quarter cup? Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, love. How come it's not liquid? It's so hot in here. Surprised. Papa. Whoopsies. Mm-hmm. Good. Perfect. Perfect. Put it in. Perfect. Perfection. You got your little spoon here to mix. Chicken is looking mix, mix, mix. semi-nifi. How much water? Two tablespoons, my dear. Actually, sometimes it needs a little more. Sometimes. Sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. You want more cheese, and then we got to make that dairy-free um, yogurt sauce. Okay. Is it good? Mix it up, Rostina. Dodo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dodo. Mm-hmm. Rose is partial to all dodos. <laughs> Key dodo. Mom. I cut a few more for later. So. Sure. Mm -hmm. Good, right? Okay. Let me fix your microphone. Maybe Rose was down. wiped after uh, the pool this morning. We were there for two and a half hours. People wonder on Instagram why we don't swim in our pool. It's because there's so many mosquitoes out there. Oh, yeah, in the back here. It's brutal. There's shrubs everywhere, so there's a lot of mosquitoes. And our pool's kind of dirty. Go out for two seconds, you get beaten like that. Yeah. I took Rose on the swing back there two days ago. I had like 10 bug bites in my leg. It was brutal. I put the active. You got to keep mixing, sweet pea. Yeah, bugs. How do you say bug? Bug. Bug. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So many bugs. Keep mixing. Everything gets incorporated. Mm -hmm. I got preheat the oven to 350, which would be 345 because this guy runs five degrees hot. 
on this control panel this oven is crazy bake 345 okay is everything in there mm-hmm looks dry as a bone oh yeah because rose keeps in Mm. Rose, you gotta keep mixing. Mix, 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 love. Eating heirloom tomatoes in the summer is like a rite of passage. Mm -hmm. Now, no tomatoes are better than Baba Donnie's. It's mixing. In Bulgaria. Those should be in season. No, they're starting now. Oh, they're not? Oh. Yeah. We always go to Bulgaria in June. There's no like tomatoes yeah. or other good stuff. Jackie had them, um, $20. Super chat is for Roasty. She is the best grocery shopper and the best sous chef. We love mm, her. Thanks. I agree. Thank you so much. It is nice to see Desi more in the live streams. I concur. How many times a day do you eat on a ketogenic diet? How many snacks do you have, if any? What do you think, Bebo? Ketogenic diet, maybe like... Breakfast like 60% always. 60% of the time. Yeah, breakfast always. Lunch. We usually have the potato chips. So it's not yeah, and quite the, keto. And the wrap and stuff. And then dinner is close to keto sometimes. Yeah. I'd say if not 50, just about 50. Otherwise, it'll be paleo. Yeah. With the, like, a potato chip yeah. here and there. A tortilla here and there made of um, <laughs> almond flour. Out the, the chips smell. A little bit of starch Chocolate in there. Chips. Keep it together. We've got to mix, mix, mix. Thank you so much, Gail. When is the new house going to be finished, says Larry. And I know. Keep, uh, keep asking our project manager. Yeah. Seems to be. Just got delayed about, what, a month or so? Yeah. It's like very bad COVID times. So everything is delayed. Yeah, it's okay. Hashtag Ask Rose. How is Rose's swimming lessons? Every day we're getting closer and closer to it. So. How are Rose's swimming lessons going? Yeah, she's already had one so far last week. And since then we've been practicing, just her and I. But we have uh, two more lessons coming up next week. And, uh, tomorrow, right? Yeah, tomorrow, one, and then Tuesday, one. I mean, the thing is, um, it's all about like getting them comfortable with like water over their face. And that's not something Rose is comfortable with yet. No. So that's taking a while. Um, yeah, they, they need to like kind of learn to like go on the water and not swallow water. So I think that's the key to uh, getting them comfortable and everything. And then, then it's like other things. But okay, so she did great here. She mixed it. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's very interesting here down in Florida. They take that very seriously, um, the swimming lessons and stuff, because everybody has a pool. Else. Everybody, there's like, there's like rivers and ponds and, and like, and canals and every everywhere yeah, like everywhere like just across the street here someone can just walk over and j go in the canal i mean there's nothing good one more like there's that. no fence or anything so, I'll, I'll so like they take that seriously here they start good um training uh little ones to swim Thank even you. at six months even younger i've heard here use and a and it's called kind hand. of like um pinch of salt rose a survival uh rescue it's called like a rescue survival um rescue. technique where they just uh, kind of like Give me some get the little, they throw the little ones in the water and they uh, and teach them to flip over on their backs right, use a spoon. Use a to spoon. Uh, survive. To, um, I need a pinch of salt in there when you get a minute. And um, uh, that's, um, I'm, no. not, I'm not signing rolls for that. It's a little extreme. I don't want to shock her with like a very kind of like um, um, traumatic experience in the beginning. So we're going a little slow the normal swimming lessons and um yeah but here uh here down in florida those like rescue lessons are Hopefully really that's popular. just the fat dripping down on that thing so i kick the heat up pretty high yeah let's see what kind of comments we got you mixing rosy yeah. okay keep mixing over here all good keep mixing we're gonna add some all more good. flavor i kicked it up to 475 which was a little too high i think uh -huh. it's just the uh yeah, the grill is smoking. The fat going off of the drip pan there. <laughs> Thank you guys, spreading the word about us. Thank you. Um, reading some of this. Whew. 
I bet Viviana's heart just save, skipped a beat. Save our house, and they're thinking it's burning again. What's that? Think it's burning again. Oh, no. Nah. Yeah, I, I thought it was too, but sometimes the Traeger, it's very hard to actually burn because there's a heat shield. The fat drips from the chicken skin, but it goes onto the heat shield and kind of ignites. I think we should put some cucumbers in there. What do you think? For the, whatever you want. Yeah, yeah you guys got to chop some We have some dill. Oh, <laughs> right. <laughs> we got to chop it first. Chop, chop, chop. Yeah. yeah, Sherry's boyfriend has a nice. Why did you move from Chicago to Florida? Change it's of paradise. Yeah, it's paradise. Change of scenery. I've been in Chicago for a long time. Didn't want to pay income taxes anymore. There's many, many reasons. Hold on, let's Because to our small. friend Erica. Yeah, it's great. Kids, uh, well, it's great for kids to be Let's outside and everything. I mean, I just couldn't imagine spending another winter with rows indoors. Nah, and brutal. In the city, there was literally nothing to do. Brutal. Last winter, so um, it was just time to go somewhere where it's a little more outdoorsy and you can have more fun. I'm going to actually wheel the trigger yeah. out a little bit so it's not smoky inside so much. And mix, mix, mix. What else should we put in there? A little olive oil, Rosie? Yeah, yeah. olive oil. Roll some lemon. Uh, some lemon juice? Here. Just a little bit. Here, you want to pour some uh, olive oil? Yeah. No, you want to keep adding yogurt. Mm -hmm. Oh, you want to eat it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. All right, okay, what else? Do an Instagram little... story here. Lemon and a little maybe garlic. Wanna gr wanna grate the garlic? The lemon? Okay. I saw smoke billowing <laughs> out of the uh, Traeger. I freaked out, I ran uh -huh. out here, but it's actually just the uh, fat coming the off of the skin yeah, onto the uh, drip tray there. There's no direct heat, so it's very hard to get a grease fryer. But the skin the is getting nice and golden Thank brown there. I'd say 10 more minutes. Yeah, Rosie's a taste sensor, yeah. Thank you, guys. That's her happy place here in the kitchen, right, Rose? And you'll love being here with Daddy. All right, you want to grate some uh, garlic? Oh, yeah, thank you, Rose. Yeah. You go, love. All right, we're making the dairy-free sauce here, the yogurt sauce. We got that yogurt from the store. Rose is grating, finely grating some garlic there. I think Rose ate half of the yogurt. Did you, Rose? Yeah, is it good? Did. Good. A little yeah. tomato salad to start a crushing The garlic, here. very Cheese strong. is not as good as I like, but it's strong. okay. And then we'll put some olive oil, yeah. salt, and pepper in there and some fresh herbs. Go like this. There you go. Here. Whoops. <laughs> here. Excuse me, guys. Just a little bit, you know, we don't want to make it too strong. RV life. So, so they're gonna they're gonna retire and do the RV life. Cool. So on. like uh, Erica. It's a good idea. Rosie, no, no, you got work to do. Uh, lemon, lemon. It's dead. It just died, Rose. I put Give it away. some lemon, please. It's dead. It's dead. Oh, nice. Yeah, Use the app slice today at Costco and Trader Joe's. Nice. Do you guys talk about the app at all or not? Just for a second. Oh, nice. Yeah, the app is available uh, on the App Store and Google Play. Just search Bobby Approved or Flay City or Bobby Parish. It's going to come up. Scan away. If you guys notice any inaccuracies or something squeezer? that's wrong, just email support at flavecity.com. And if you ever okay, see a camera icon after you scan something, please take a new photo. That means we need an updated photo. It's old or the ingredients are outdated because makers change ingredients. Any Bobby approved men's body washes you recommend? I don't use body wash. Uh, I just use bar soap, but I use a really good one from uh, Whole Foods. It's the Good Soap Company. And um, body washes, I don't know. I'm, I'm sure a Cure makes a very good one. Uh, I'll, bet, I'll bet Pure Haven makes a really good one too. What else we put in there? Yeah, nice. Nice roast good. time. Is there enough salt or something? Uh, you have to check it. Two of my friends have it. I spread the word. Nice, Martha. Yeah, we actually haven't advertised it at all besides a couple of live streams, because it's still a soft launch, yet we still have about uh, 11,000 downloads because we're still building the database. So I have to manually go through uh, hundreds of products every night, and I have currently about 7,000 to go through. So we don't want to be like overwhelmed with it. Thank you, Shari. 
Nice. Bon Bon bought the Cure oh Face God. Wash from oh, Thrive Market. Is it good? Purist is a good it. clean body wash. Yeah, Purist is a good brand too. Have I ever made buffalo cauliflower? Yes, many years ago, and I think the recipe is still on my website. Search Google oh, search yeah. uh, Flav City it's buffalo awesome. cauliflower. It's actually a cool recipe. Mm. What is the keto cookie dough promo? Oh, that was for Boo Boo Keto B H U Keto. Uh, code Flav City got you twenty percent off. And tonight I'll have a uh, free shipping promo for Coconut Bliss ice cream because it's National uh, Ice Cream Day. Unfortunately, oh, they don't have that at Thrive Market. How's the flavor? Good? I didn't try it. Looks good, Rose. Yeah, Rose did it. Mm. The whole thing. Touch more. Oh, that's no, perfect, actually. Rose. She did the whole thing. That's lovely. No. Wow, that's so good, Rose time. <laughs> You're so good. Rosie, give me a boom. 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 <laughs> <laughs> You're the cutest, Rose. You are the cutest. Yeah, that's the... Uh, the hair wash. How do you wash your hair, Rose? How do you wash your hair? Like that, yeah, exactly. That's a good wash. That's the Acure. Get that. When you use my promo code for Thrive Market, the bottle's $3 cheaper than Whole Foods. The Acure shampoo and conditioner. Conditioner's been sold out for three months on uh, Thrive mm, Market. Good. I have no idea what's going on. But it's even cheaper when you use thrivemarket.com slash bobbylive in the description box. Get 25% off your first order, too. It's a no-brainer. Because if you don't love Thrive Market, I made sure you can cancel after 30 days, get your $60 membership Hold fee on, let back, me sit, let me sit but at least try it. It's risk-free and the savings are <laughs> too legit to quit. <laughs> Where do you want to sit? This chair or that chair? Here, I'll sit. Do you think you want more of that bread seriously for dinner? Oh, or? yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm probably not going to have too much starch, so I'll have something else. Never. The grill has a... Uh, How's the grill? Almost stopped smoking now. So I, I kick the heat up to 460, which means when the fat is dripping on the pan, it's incinerating immediately. Didn't, didn't start a fire. It was just a lot of smoke. But it always scares me, given my checkered past. What is this one? Let's see. All right. Everyone knows what I'm talking about back in Chicago. Mm -hmm. We don't talk about those days anymore. This one of is the grill. Nah, nah. So nice. I have a nice nah, salad like this. Nah, nah. Mm, nah, like in the book. Remember? It smells nice. Like in the book. Nah. Mm hmm. The Leo and Melody go to the farm? Yeah, Montessori way. Thank you, Frank. Just downloaded the app. Thank you so much. Mm-hmm. Want to smell it? Thrive Market has frozen bread. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Where are you going with it? How do you prevent separation after immersion blending soups? I don't really have that problem, but if you do, just mix it up by hand. Alicia, when would the lemonade be available in Dubai? I don't know. That'd be an Erica question. So I know the shipping is ungodly yeah. expensive. The only place yeah. the lemonade ships now like is to uh, yeah. Canada. But the lemonade's amazing. Yeah, Everyone who's tasted it loves it. They go to the lavender field here? The only complaint has been that it's expensive. It smells the same. Yeah, it's a lavender. little premium of product because we lavender. use really good products. And we're a small mm -hmm. company. That's it, lavender. It's 30 servings for $30. So it's twice the price of like one you get at the grocery store. Yeah. But the ingredients are epic. I mean, look at the, my favorite, pink grapefruit lemonade. How do we get pink grapefruit in there? Well, we used real crystallized freeze-dried grapefruit. We used beetroot powder, non-GMO erythritol, the most expensive stevia money can buy, so it has no cooling effect. But see the acerola there? Because I put acerola in there, a one eight ounce serving has 100% of your daily value of vitamin C. Mm -hmm. And the same is true for the original one. So check it out. Shopflavecity.com has a promo code at the top. Shopflavecity.com. It's a premium product. And yeah, it costs a little more. Costs will come down eventually, but there's nothing on the market like this. And you're gonna have your one net gram keto diabetic lemonade with 100% of your daily uh, value of vitamin C. Man down. Manda, just water, it's okay. Oh, too many things are going off now. That's to check the chicken. I had a feeling when I put that water there, that was gonna happen actually. Oh really? You made, you made oh, my time machine come true. The tea tree? Oh, excuse me guys, I'm blocking the camera. Been using a lot of this on Rose lately. She's had a lot of boo-boos. Mm -hmm. The Active Skin Repair, an amazing product. Actually, Brad got me into. 
It's like Neosporin, but it's mm -hmm. completely non-toxic, non-petroleum based. Amazing stuff. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Okay. Rose is applying a, a mixture of uh, sweet almond oil and tea tree on her uh, bug bites. Nice. Yeah. Rose is a pocket. Oh, no, it's nice. too much. It's gonna. It's gonna I gotta spill. go check the temperature of the uh, chicken. I bet you it's can done. You put your finger in there. Yeah. And, there and I'll need. See, it gets all. You got all oil. And I'll need. You got it. You have so much now this. in your finger. They don't need that. Yep. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Mama. That's enough. Yeah, you can stick your finger in there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, then, and then you can put on your bug bites. Yeah? The bug bites. Yeah, that helps. Well, it's a huge iguana. Mm -hmm. Wow. I have one on your leg here. Hmm? The mosquito. The mosquito picture. Hmm? Ma. Mm hmm. Do I have any? Yeah. Mm -hmm. No more. No more. No more. Good. Thank you. Yeah, very nice. All right. <sighs> Done now. Yeah, dinner is almost ready. Ready to eat on the big table? Yeah. On the big table? Yeah. No, where do you want to eat? On the counter? Yeah. On the counter? Yeah. There or there? Where do you want to eat? There. Over there? No, down. Tam. Mm -hmm. Tam means over there in Bulgarian. She still uses some words in Bulgarian and some in English. Right, Rose? Because you learn a lot of stuff from Baba. Yeah, Baba Whoa. Gentle, they're all falling on the ground. Just about done. Skin's not quite as crisp as I want it because I had to turn the temperature down because it was uh, smoking. How can you finish the skin somehow? You, you can't. You can't? No. Can you like torch it or something? Uh, nah, I don't, I'm not a fan of using like a propane torch to, the, to do that kind of stuff. Okay, let me uh, toast some more. Are you Bones. eating all the veggies, Rose? Are you eating them all? Oh, actually, for me. The pear? The pear? So here's the low carb option. If you wanted to make a low carb easy. dinner right now that was keto and Desi's using those rolls, you would use this. This is the outer aisle pizza crust. I'm actually going to put this on the outdoor Traeger <laughs> so it bakes while it's. Uh, You're going to have those? I'm going to, yeah, I'm just going to make one. Should I make more than one? No, it's fine. I'll have one. Yeah. The bun is so good. Bun, bun, bun. Bun, 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 bun. Baga, baga. Yeah. Mars, we already put the, the $10 holler. The bun Any bun. idea why base culture and unbun refuse to make a keto-friendly hot dog oh, bun? We said the also, the burger buns from unbun are too thick and add the shape. It's so frustrating. I didn't even know unbun made a hamburger bun. They just make buns, and they are frustratingly uh, big. Base culture has a new dinner roll bun. I haven't tried it yet. I have it in my freezer. But I don't know why they're not making a hot dog or hamburger bun. The market is primed for that. I'll email uh, the CEO. Jordan. Diana's here. Can you explain to everyone how you get the Flav Fam emojis? Uh, yes. So if you join the Flav City channel, which is right by the subscribe button, uh, you will get access to 12 or 15 emojis supporting the channel. It's a nice donation what to the channel. I think it's four ninety nine every month. You don't have to do it, but when you do it, Put you get a forks, green badge next to your name, so everyone knows you're a your channel member, yeah. and you get access to emojis. You just have to type colon, and you'll see the emojis pop up. Bobby, Rose, Desi emojis, all that stuff. Yeah, there we go. Lala just did it. Exactly. All right, Michelle. Brad had to move back to Chicago. Uh, while we were gone, he had to move yeah. back. He had some family uh, family issues. He unfortunately had to attend to. It was a bummer. Ah, the coconut harvesting guy would be a good sidekick. <laughs> That's funny, go Jujang. Yeah, I don't know. That guy's a little wild. I don't know if he's reliable. <laughs> That's right. hilarious. Let's let's clean up here and set the table. Yeah. Remember that coconut harvesting guy when it came? That was like right after we moved. No one's been here lately. Yeah. There's a lot of coffee. One other guy came. There was that other guy. A lot of people have been coming for the mangoes. Yeah, people came for our mangoes. We think some people came while we were in Bulgaria and wiped out our mango tree. The one outside. 
Yeah, because they're all gone. And yes, they so were we coming off early, but this thing? seems a, a bit go. early. There we go. All set. You want to sit? No. All right. All right. I can hear the, that's just the timer. Yep, timer. That's why I opened the window. Okay. BRB. That's why you get the, the probe thermometer, right? No, With the hot alarm hot. on there. Yeah, so hot. you don't overcook it. See how it's going off? It goes off when I tell it yeah, to reach my internal temperature. I said, so I said, please go off at 158 degrees. That's exactly what it did. Come on. So I'm going to take my chicken off. I'm not taking the probe out yet because I don't want the juices to come out. But I'll get the chicken, which actually looks quite lovely. Get that out. I want to grab my uh, cauliflower thin here. Can somebody search on Thrive Market since they sell frozen bread? Do they sell outer aisle cauliflower thins? Or any kind of cauliflower thin? I'll just bake that for about six or seven minutes. Look at that chicken, Rosie. Look at the chicken, Rosanna. Look at that. Ooh, is that good? Yeah. So chicken's done. But you have to let it rest at least 10 minutes, ideally 20. See, I was hoping the chicken skin would get a little more crispy. It didn't. But that's okay. It's just that smoke kind of threw me off. It scared me. Yeah. But weren't for that smoke. I could have uh, Come, uh, let that high heat really crisp up. Oh, can you guys uh, scoop the cookie dough and get it in the oven? Do you mind? Rose is ready in the, at the table now. She's ready to eat. Oh, oh, what do you want to eat? Uh, I think we might need to cut one more tomato, babe. Sure. There's no chicken to eat yet, though. Yeah, how, I mean, how many minutes? <laughs> did you not hear my spiel I just did? 10 to 20 minutes. I mean... 20? Come on. Cut some more <coughs> tomatoes and let's eat. Okay. Hold on. We got to uh, cut some more bread, too. Bread, seriously. Right up. <laughs> you have to let it rest. 15, 20 minutes. Rose is ready. Cut it now. <laughs> right, Rosie? I mean, right. if you want to cut a piece off her, you can do it. Rose breaks all rules. I'm totally fine with that. Yeah, if there's a bunch of repeated questions, you let me know. Some lemon on that chicken. <laughs> I like the way you think, Goju Jang. I like the way you think. Although last time you said lemon, it squirted it in Rose's eye, right? Can I the fork for a second? All right, can you please put it down? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Viviana. Bobby, can you please tell Brianna that palm oil is the devil? Who's Brianna? Whoever Brianna is? Yes, palm oil. First of all, horrible for the environment. Why don't you feed Second them? of all, horrible for hey, you. It's hungry. highly processed, highly inflammatory, highly refined. It's cheap as can be. Why does no one cook with palm oil in their kitchen? Can't even buy it at the grocery store. But all the manufacturers use it because it's cheap as can be. Got the yogurt sauce. Hey, let me just slice a little piece of uh, chicken breast for roasting. You want some chicken, love? I'll roasting serve you in a second. does not wait for anyone. Now, the reason why you don't do this is because when you cut into hot chicken, the juices will come out. So by doing this now, juices will run, but it's okay. Here you go, Rose. Oh, look how juicy that breast is, mommy. Wow. Oh, wow. That's yummerton, Rose. I'm giving you the best piece, Rose Teen. Thank you. And Daddy's gonna at least eat the skin if Oh, my skin. No. Go, Jujang. Jane. That's a good point. While the chicken's resting, why don't we squeeze some lemon over, right? Grand idea. Why don't we take some Thrive Market ghee, any kind of grass-fed ghee, spoon that over too, right? Keep that chicken nice and happy. 
infuse even more sabor. Oh, yeah. My favorite part actually is taking off the wings. There you go, love. Oh, yeah. You want the fork? Wings don't have to redistribute the heat, so what I can do is get that off. Is it hot? Just blow on it, Rose. It's really hot. Oh, babe. Ooh, careful, hot. careful with Too that hot. wing. I know you want to eat it. Too hot. <laughs> It'll burn your stomach. <laughs> it's hot, Rosie. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to cut this tomato. Huh? I'll do it here. You got to wash it. Wash it. got a wing. Push the meat down like this. Ooh, hot. See, push the meat off of the uh, thing and then dip it. Where's that yogurt sauce? <laughs> dip it in that yogurt sauce. It's one of my favorite things to do with wings. Look at that, all the meat just falls out, right? You want me to scoop these cookies now or later? No! Need a sheet tray. Mmm! Wow. That is epic. Dang, son. Really lovely. I don't love these uh, heirloom tomatoes. Not as good as usual. Mm. Tomatoes can be so hit or miss when you don't grow them yourselves. You know? Yeah. No uh, balsamic on this one, Goju Jing. Sorry. <laughs> Butter and olive oil, right? Why not? Nice, Dusty scooping that layered cookie. Very excited. Yeah, added a little more water. I think it needed it. Sure. Is it good? <laughs> Let me see. No, no, what? You're giving me back the chicken? Mmm. I've got it, man. That's so good. Oh, wait for daddy then. Yummy. Yummy in our tummy. All rolls. right. Is the oven ready? It is. Chicken wing umbrella. Exactly. Who cleans up the kitchen, Dusty? Yeah. Who do you think, you guys? <laughs> Rose? <laughs> I wish. Maybe one day. Yeah, one second. I'm just finishing. She actually dinner. does help uh, put the plates back. Uh, put the plate and uh, give the plates to daddy once we're uh, finished eating. So that's great. She's already helping a little bit. Almost done, Rose. Uh huh. You want, me to, you want me to sit there? Okay, let me just finish the chicken right here. We're coming. We're, we're coming, Rosie. We're all coming. They say they're like pat these down actually. You have to pet them now. Hold on, I just gotta pour some keto wine, Rosie. This dinner's begging for some keto wine. What is keto wine? It's wine made without added sugar, without any chemicals. And it's the chemicals and sugar and the chemicals in wine that give you a headache, not sulfites. And most wines have added sugar to the fermentation process. That's why they have three and a half grams of carbs. All right, all done. This one has you wanted to do the cookies. I know. zero I added know. sugar. So there's 0.3 natural carbs in there. Vacuum sealer. You wanted the cookie dough? Well, we're going to bake the cookies. You're going to have a cookie later on with some ice cream. Oh, yeah. cookies and ice cream. Because it's and National ice cream. ice cream. I think Bobby is more excited about giving Rose ice cream than she is. <laughs> I derive he a lot of to indulge her. I derive a lot of pleasure See, from He that. loves to indulge her. I'm going to make you a meat umbrella, babe. Mm. Mmm, wow. Crazy, right? I'm gonna make you a meat umbrella. Huh? Mm. I'm gonna make this for mommy real quick, Rose. Yeah, I'm. Oh, this so one's good. for mommy. Hold on. This one's for mama. Hold on. Nothing says I love you like giving one of the meat umbrellas. Yeah. I'll make one for you, Robo. Here you go, mama. Like this, babe? Yeah, I gotta feed you carnivore stuff. This is how the caveman would do it. Mmm. Wow. Crazy, right? Everyone's just like, oh, hello. That's unbelievable. Hello. Mm. Mm, yummy. You all good? You want to dip it? Okay. You want to dip the, the chicken rolls? I gave you the dip over there. All right, let's go. I think roses. Okay. 
All right. Very hungry. That is it, you guys. Awesome time hanging out. Easy, healthy summer dinner, right? Yeah. I'm coming over, Rosie. I'm coming over. Hmm? Yeah, I'm going to bring more chicken for you. Um, once again, check out Thrive Market using the promo link down below. Get 25% off your first order. That's it. I'm coming, Rose. All right. Later, guys. Bye, guys. You want to dip the chicken? You want a wing to dip in there? Here. You got to give her, like, the bone. Yeah, she wanted to dip something. Here. You can dip this and dip this, Rose. I'm sorry. The wing was for Mommy and Daddy, but you can have this one here. Take that and be careful. There's still some meat on there. Mm-hmm. There's still some meat on there. I think your bread is done. Thank you. Oh, and my, uh, my tortilla. Is that good? No more? I'll get you another one. Hope your tortilla didn't burn. There we go. Is it good, Russ? You wanted the bone. Yeah. Yummy. This is why I love this uh, cauliflower thing. See? You just grill it like that. It's keto. It's gluten-free. It's amazing. All right, guys. That's it. Russ, say goodbye to everyone. Yeah, done. We're done. Bye. I'll get you. A, yeah, I'm going to get you a nice uh, chicken. Say bye again. So you can see. Bye, guys. Love you. <laughs> Later, y'all. <laughs>